and welcome to On The Mat TV. We're here at Gracie Barra Horwich and we've got here, introduce yourself guys. Uh, my name is Brandon Eves. Uh, my name is Jacob Fairclough and I'm 12. Oh, happy days. So what, what got you into jiu-jitsu, guys? What got you, you know, what, what introduced you to, to, to making your way down here and getting involved? Well, um, I've always been interested in the sport and my dad really likes uh, the combat sports as well. Like I said, uh, like Brandon said, my dad's like really good in like fighting and stuff like that. So I've looked up to him and wanted to do it as well. That's fantastic, absolutely fantastic. So, in terms of advice you would give to guys your age, what would you say to them if they're sitting on the sideline and they're, they're thinking about it? What advice would you give to them personally? If you're ever like in a situation where you're in a fight, you just gotta try and avoid it as much as you can. And fighting should be your last resort. Wise words. What about yourself? I um basically never back down and never give up really and that that's that's also a very very good quality to have in you know when when we're in this game uh, but in terms of what does it what what can it do for you what has it done for you on and off the mat well it teaches a lot of discipline and it it's it just infuses that that idea of being athletic yeah Keeping fit and and having a good friend circle and just you know and just being right mentally and physically. What about yourself? What would you say it's done for you on and off the mat? Like like Brandon said, just teaches you back and pretty much everything he said as well. It's such a brilliant sport. It's very disciplined and and like you touched on it before. What in terms of combat sports? What sports personalities would you say that you look up to or you follow or you or you're excited by? Quite like um, Gordon Ryan and yeah, yeah. Khabib, he's a, he's a very good ground, ground fighter yeah, as well. Like, I look up to like John Jones and Charles Oliveira, like main MMA, MMA people as well. Wow. Fantastic role models to be looking up to because they're all doing fa absolutely fantastic in the, and they've all got really good ground game as well. Some of the guys that you pointed out, they're all like high level practitioners, which is fantastic. So what, what would you say was your favourite submission? Probably Americana. Ooh, Americana. What would you say yours was? Either maybe like a triangle or a rear naked choke. <laughs> Some brutal ones there. And in the future, guys, are, are you thinking about competing or have you competed? Um, I'm thinking of competing, yeah. I want, I'd like to go. I'd like to progress from my way and get as bad, as good as I could. Absolutely brilliant. And what about yourself? Yeah, same. I'm like currently looking for a competition, like ready to do it already. Definitely, definitely recommend that you you get involved. Uh, and just on a final note, is there anything that you you would like to say to any children or any kids your age that may or may not be watching this, to inspire them, to to take up this sport? Just like keep positive and like never give up, never back down. Just keep yourself like happy. That's it. Brilliant. And just do it. Just get involved. What about yourself? Yeah, just like keep positive. You'll learn a lot in it, outside of the mats and on side, like in loads of situations as well. Well, thank you very much for that, guys. And moving on in the future, we'll be we'll be tending quite a lot of the competitions, and we really do hope to see you there in the future. And 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 we will be coming back here at some point, and hopefully uh, get to see you guys grow in in the future. So thank you very much for giving us the interview. Happy days. Thank you.